God is the loving ruler of this world. He made it and everything in it, including us. But everyone has turned their back on God. But the great news is that God has paid for us to come back to him. Let me tell you a story that will help us to understand what God did to bring us back. There once was a little girl and this little girl loved one thing, kites. And one day she decided to make her very own kite. Oh, she spent all morning working and working and working away on her very own kite until finally she was finished. It looked beautiful. She carefully picked it up and walked around the outside of her house up the hill behind her house. Ah, perfect weather for flying her kite. She carefully, ever so carefully, let out the string of her kite and she watched it go up, up, up into the blue sky. The gentle breeze picked it up and it danced across the clouds and the sun shone on it making it sparkle and shine. Oh, the little girl loved her new kite. Suddenly, the string started to get tight. The little girl pulled back a bit and it, it pulled it further into the sky. She looked around and there behind her were thick, dark clouds. The wind picked up and started pulling her kite up. The little girl pulled back she pulled more and more until the string broke and her kite flew up, up, up and got swallowed by the thick, dark clouds. The little girl's kite was gone. A few weeks later, the little girl was walking down the street, looking in all the shop windows, when, su when suddenly, there in the shop window, she saw her kite, the kite that she had made, the kite that had been swallowed up by the thick, dark clouds. There it was in the shop window. The little girl was so filled with joy and excitement that she ran into the shop. She called out to the shopkeeper and said, excuse me, that kite, that kite belongs to me. The shopkeeper came over and she looked at the little girl. She looked at the kite and she said, that kite, that kite will cost you $10, please. The little girl looked at the shopkeeper and she said, no, you don't understand. That kite, I made that kite. That kite belongs to me. It belongs to me. The shopkeeper looked at the little girl again and she looked at the kite and said, that kite, that kite will cost you $10, please. The little girl looked back at the shopkeeper once more and said, but I made that kite. I love that kite. That kite belongs to me. The shopkeeper frowned at the little girl. Little girl, if you want that kite, you'll need to pay $10, please. The little girl realised that the shopkeeper was not going to give back the kite. So she dug deep into her pocket and she pulled out $10. She handed it to the shopkeeper and the kite was hers once more. The little girl smiled and as she walked home, she hugged the kite tight and said, you're mine twice, once because I made you and twice because I bought you back. Children, God says that we are his twice, once because he made us and twice because he bought us back. God paid for us to come back to him and it cost him a lot. It cost him the death of his son, Jesus, 
That's how precious each one of us is to him. And because we belong to God, then everything we say, think and do matters to him. So children, if you belong to God, live your life pleasing him.